boy. Stop watching TV. Go clean your room. Get good grades so you have a good future. And uh, everything I say go in one ear and up the other. These are the words most Malaysian mothers tell their children. Good morning, Contest Chair, Honorable Judges and Guests, Teachers and Fellow Students. My name is Faris Daniel. I would like to share with you a painful experience of mine when I was 10 years yes. old and the lesson I learned from this experience. Yes. It was the start of COVID pandemic and there was MCO. Schools were closed and children were bored at home without friends to play with. I asked my mother for permission to ride my bicycle outside. Mom said, yes, but remember to play around this area. Don't wander off too far away till you can find your way home. Don't go up to hill because before she could finish, I was already up the cake, pedaling off to the distance. I was from one end of the road to the other end of the road, pretending to be an Olympic cyclist. Cool breeze cold my face on the humid day. However, the flat road presented no challenge to me, and I wondered if I had. My more fun cycling up path on the hill instead. The gravel path did not look at all, just a slight slope. I believe I could do it without much difficulties. <clears throat> yes, I can do it. I will do it. Off I went, pedaling faster and faster, going up slightly higher and higher. Rattle, 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 clink, toop. Both the bicycle and I rolled down the hillside. My body ate all over face, elbows, arms, legs, chest, and back. There were scratches here and there. The chain of my bicycle has also broken. I pushed the bike and limped my way back home. Fellow students, the next time your mother tell you to do or not to do something, heed her advice because who knows best? Mothers knows best. Thank you.